I got a plan. This is probably a stupid plan. Hey guys, the Reverend Worm here. And um here I am back in my rant tower. Haven't really built anything on to the top of it yet, but I've been working on my mine. Uh, I ended up taking this spiral staircase all the way down to bedrock and establishing a little bit of a base down there. And um Later today, I think I'm going to be starting my branch mine down there. But, uh, first, I found a little bit of iron, and I'm going to use that to make a pick, and I think a bucket. Oh, let me go ahead and turn this off. Won't be needing that. <laughs> Usually I try to turn that off before I start, but wasn't thinking about it. Ah, uh, my first iron pickaxe. And my first bucket. And I would almost make some shears while I'm at it, but I don't really, I don't think I'm going to have much of a use for any wool for a while. Um, I'm going to put my iron pick away. And actually I'm going to do something that I said I don't normally do. <laughs> I'm actually going to need some a good supply of wood uh, pretty soon. So I'm going to go ahead and chew up all these bones into bone meal and give my tree farm a little bit of a workout. Oh, also, I added in this window here, and I plan on chopping down this ugly tree right outside. But, uh, gonna have a nap first. <laughs> um, I finally got a couple mods installed. I've got the, uh, I've got more creatures. Mo creatures, whichever you wanna, <laughs> whichever way you wanna say it, and I've also got the baby animals mod. Oh, there's a puppy! Oh no, and I just used all my bones. Oh, oh. Well, I could have got that puppy, but oh well. But yes, uh, the baby animals mod, one of my favorite mods. Um, I'm not really gonna have time to play around with them that much today. But, oh, look, it's a puppy! <laughs> this really is one of my favorite mods, and sometimes I get weird looks when I say that, because, you know, I'm a guy, and we're not supposed to like cute things, but in all honesty, this mod isn't just about cuteness. It's got, you know, a lot of content there that, that really uh, makes the game a lot funner for me and um... from what i've been hearing you know word around the forum is that in one point eight the next update baby animals mod might just get to be part of the vanilla game uh... just like the pistons mod i mean i'm sure they're gonna tweak it quite a bit like pistons but, you know, I for one am, am really happy about that, because the Baby Animals mod, just, it, it's fun. Fun as could be. But yeah, I'll play around with that uh, in the future. Um, oh, one thing. Uh, <laughs> one of my viewers deserves a awesomely huge shout out uh if you watched my latest episode of Worms World I had a little thing that uh well it was kind of a reference to an old show that I loved as a kid and uh I said that the first person to get the reference gets you know a major major shout out and 
that goes out to Pretty Paul HD. He got that uh, my reference came from an old episode of Inspector Gadget. And honestly, I didn't think anyone was going to get that at all, let alone, you know, so soon. It That's pretty crazy. So, uh, yeah, way to go, Pretty Paul HD. That was awesome of you to get that. And I checked your channel, and it said you're only 16. So, <laughs> you know, you either get major props for watching a show that came on before you were born, or, uh, you know, you're just very excellent with the Google search, <laughs> one or the other. But either way, major props, and uh, thanks for not making me feel like an idiot with a reference that no one gets. Wow, looks like my trees down here have grown pretty well on their own. There's a baby pig. Aww. <laughs> wow, there are a lot of puppies around here. I really wish I had kept a couple of those bones. And if I'd realized how well my trees have grown, I probably would have. Oh well, that's just the way it goes. I'm going to run out of axe before I run out of trees to chop. Uh, oh well. <laughs> That's what I get for doing something that I said I I don't do. I guess. No puppy for me. <laughs> well, anyway. <laughs> um, I hope you've been enjoying my piston tutorials. I've been having a lot of fun making those. Um, I'm kind of running out of ideas, though. I don't really know what the next one is going to be about. Actually, no, I do know what the next one's going to be about. <laughs> but I'll leave that for my video then. Uh, I hope you enjoy that I've been... Or, well, I hope you like that I've been... Uh, not using my texture pack for those videos. I kind of I love my texture pack and I really I always want to use it when I'm just playing around, but I know for uh tutorials and stuff it kind of you know, a lot of people want to be able to clearly tell what you're doing and sometimes with a texture pack it's not so easy. So I've been turning that off whenever I do tutorials and I think I'm going to continue to do it like that. Just, you know, for everybody to to be able to, you know, get it, <laughs> really. To be able to not have to wonder, you know, what is this, what is that. Um, I'm going to finish chopping down these massive trees. And, uh, whoops. No, I guess I'm not going to do that, because I don't have an axe now. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to head back <laughs> to the house. Uh, make myself another axe. And, whoops. And then come back and chop the rest of these trees. And, um... Yeah, I'll see you when I'm done with that. Well, look who we have here. Somebody trespassing on my property. Normally I wouldn't care, but this guy appears to be afflicted with lycanthropy. Ah, and he's coming right towards me. <laughs> okay. He was also threatening me. You saw it. If you didn't know, that guy, yeah, is going to turn into a werewolf at night. And I do not want that anywhere near my house. I don't have any gold to defend myself. Because, for some reason in this game, werewolves hate gold. Instead of silver. Well, I shouldn't say in this game, I should say in this mod. But, mod, this mod being part of the game now, blah blah blah. 
Yeah. I <laughs> just, uh... Thought I'd kill that guy real quick. Um... So, yeah, I've been working on... Chopping down lots of trees. And this is mostly so I can, uh... Start a farm. With the baby animals. You know, one of the features about it that I like is pretty much the ability to actually start your own farm. And, uh... I'm gonna be doing that. Building a nice little farmhouse. And, uh... Get out of here, bird! And, uh... <laughs> sorry, got distracted there. But, yeah, I'm gonna build my own little farmhouse, and, uh, need a, needed, uh, quite a bit of wood for that. I'm not gonna start that just today, but I am gonna go ahead and use up the rest of this axe, because I think it'll get used up before my bone meal. Whoops. And then, whoops, there, there it was. I've got another axe, but I don't really want to chop any more trees. I'm getting bored. <laughs> That's, you know... Shut up. <laughs> Chase this stupid thing away. But yeah, that's one of the things about Minecraft. There's, there's a lot to do, so... You can just work on something until you get bored, and then go do something else. Like I'm about to do. God, I have I have plenty of wood now. Lots of saplings. I'm not even gonna bother picking up any more saplings. And uh Yeah, I'm gonna head on back up to the to the tower. The start of the tower. I really need to finish that if I'm gonna keep calling it a tower. <laughs> but I don't think I'm going to do that today either, because like I said, I want to get down to my mine and get me some good stuff out of there. And, uh, let's see, I am going to make me a bunch of picks and get to mine and grab some wood here. Alright guys, I'll uh, meet you down there. Oh, hmm. Well, it's... Eh, it's getting dark. I was going to go down to the ocean and get me some water so I can set up an infinite water spring here at my base so that I don't have to run down to the ocean whenever I want water. Um... <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to do that this episode, just not right now. Alright, here I am, heading down this terribly long spiral staircase. That's one of the reasons I want to get some water here at the house. I'm going to make a quick drop with a, you know, just put a water break down at the end of this, you know, hole. <laughs> So I can go ahead and just jump straight down into it and not have to walk all the way down here. Of course, going back up is still going to be a pain. And here we are. I got down to uh, layer 10 and just came right into the corner of this perfect little lava pool area. And I decided this is going to be my mining base. I'm uh, probably going to make it a little safer in here, put up something between me and the lava so I don't just take a dive, but, you know, I'm not going to take the lava out or cover it up with the, with make it obsidian or anything like that. I hate that. <laughs> when I see people, you know, wandering around in caves and just dumping water all over their lava, I just cringe a little. I don't know why. 
just that's one of the things that bugs me. Probably should have made a shovel. Hmm. I didn't bring anything down here to make a shovel. Oh, if you're wondering why this chest works, I just dug out a block above it so I could open it up. Uh, I really need to bring some supplies down here. But, whatever. Oh, and this is where I just went on down to bedrock to make sure that I really was there. As you can see, I found some gold down here that I haven't mined out yet. That's what I needed my iron pick for. And I've left that in my chest. <laughs> so, awesome. And, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and start a branch mine going off in this direction. Just dig out this gravel. I wonder how much is here. Probably a lot, knowing my luck, so... <laughs> is going to be probably pretty boring so <laughs> I'm going to going to go ahead and cut to a uh, more interesting part. Oh, well here's a more interesting part right here. I found some <laughs> found some lapis. Oh. <laughs> well, not like I can do anything with that, but always good to find stuff. It's a successful mine already. <laughs> okay, guys. I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, guys. I've uh, finished the first uh, stretch of my branch mine. Laid it all out. 50 blocks in this direction. And uh, a doorway every two blocks. Or, well with two blocks in between every doorway. And as you can see, I've already found quite a bit of fun stuff down here. But, you know, I'm <laughs> I'm out of torches. And I didn't bother to bring any wood down here or my iron pick that I'm going to need to mine that redstone and that uh, gold. So, yep, back up the horrible winding staircase. I'm thinking about the Better Than Wolves mod. I really am. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's such a cool looking mod, and I, I really do want to install that. I really do. I just, uh, uh, I don't know. I'm probably going to do it. <laughs> but yeah, since it's daytime now, I'm going to head on down to the ocean. Hmm, or maybe, well, no, I think I'll have to head to the ocean to get some water. What do we got here? Oh, a duck. Stupid duck. <laughs> I don't think there was an actual pool of water over here. I know there's this waterfall. Yeah, it just it just flows on the ground. Um hmm. There's wild grass, but no actual grass on that. Weird. Uh, okay. <laughs> I've got a lot of plans for this world once I get established. Like I said, I'm going to be starting a nice farm with the Baby Animals mod. And uh, of course, Mo Creatures. Going to get me some horses. Here's some dolphins. Or are those sharks? No, those are dolphins. <laughs> be hard to tell sometimes. Uh, oh, there's a horse. Oh, it's getting dark, isn't it? Alright, let me 
run back to the house as fast as I can. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Yeah, I guess you can tell I'm a little bit of a chicken when it comes to fighting mobs in this game. <laughs> um, you know, not that I won't go out and, and fight, but... Oh, it's a deer. But, um, yeah, I guess my style of play, I just prefer to end up, uh, end up building myself a house that's pretty much self self sufficient enough that I don't have to go outside and deal with horrible monsters on a regular basis. So there we go, I'm safe. Alright, uh I'm going to put this water infinite water spring God <laughs> I'm gonna put it in my basement now that I've managed to get down here. But um where to put it? I'm gonna do kind of a weird one. A design that I really enjoyed uh I'm not sure where I saw it. Um yeah, I'm gonna put it right here. And it's uh it's a neat design because you can set it into the wall. You just put a water source here and a water source under here and uh take your water out of the middle. Uh oh, I think my power might be going off. So I'm okay, I'm gonna gonna pause here. Okay guys, sorry about that. That was weird. Oh god, tiger. Ah ah I just got ambushed by a creeper and now a tiger. <laughs> but uh yeah, my um power was just doing something weird. Oh crap crap. I was afraid my power was going out, but it seems fine now. Huh. Well, I'm headed back over to get myself another bucket of water so I can finish making that water spring. Um, I guess I could just grab it from here. Oh, let me. There we go. All right. Uh, I'm not really sure how long I've been recording. I've been <laughs> cutting in and out. I, I've decided I'm going to try and keep these worms world, or er, well, blah, blah blah. That's not what this is. I decided I'm going to try and keep these uh, Rev Rants videos to you know about 30 minutes, since I can upload those videos now. Die, werewolf man. Oh god, the lag saved him. You're hurting me! Stop it! You're hurting me! Stop it! <laughs> oh boy, wooden tools. That's awesome. <laughs> what am I going to do with some wooden tools, really? I mean, you can't even put them in a furnace and use them as fuel. You should be able to, in my opinion. Because what do you do when you get done with your wooden tools? I mean, as soon as you get enough to make a stone pick, you, you completely ditch wooden tools, right? So why not make them, you know, fuel? Make them go in the stupid <laughs> furnace. Uh, that's what I would do with it. <laughs> Baby chicken. Oh, <laughs> uh, chickens are annoying, and I don't just mean in this game. I mean actual chickens are annoying. I uh, have a few. I have a rooster that likes to stand right outside my window and crow every morning, and uh, I'm kind of a night person, so in the morning I'm ready to go to sleep. And yeah, it doesn't work very well.
for me, anyway. Alright, what was I doing? That's that's a good question. What was I doing? Um Oh, yeah. This is what I was doing. Go on, go down. God, I don't I don't like those trap doors really. I don't like them. I get stuck on them more than more than anything. Okay, there we go. Got one source block under here, one under here. So I've got an in infinite water spring in the middle. And it's, you know, nice and concealed. You're not going to fall in it. It's in the wall. Really pretty simple idea. Um, I'm going to take this stack of wood here and head on down. I'll leave. No, I'll take the sticks with me. And I'm going to head on down to the... Uh, bottom of my mine and put in a water break so I can just oh wait mmm uh... yeah let me well I don't really need to grab any coal because there's a ton of it down there but I'm gonna go ahead and do that make some torches and I'll see you at the bottom of the mine alright guys I just got done putting in the water break at the bottom of this mine shaft and uh gonna test it out. Whoa <laughs> Yeah that that works fine. Um gonna come in and you know make it all look nicer later. But uh right now it's just a matter of convenience. Um but yeah, I think that's going to be all from me. And I'm just going to be mining down here a little bit. See what I can come up with. Already looks like a pretty good spot. And uh yeah, next time I'm going to be playing around with some of the mods I installed. Start my farm. And, um, well, that's all for me, guys. Later. <laughs> Die, you suckers. Oh, God. Come here. Come here, I need your bones. Oh, God. Not this again. Hiding in the corners. Oh god, oh god! Okay, need to be inside now, I'm dying. Lag. Lag. Bad lag. Jerks. 